United Methodist Church back in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, and on our team members here, I extend our thanksgiving to all of you. The working men that work with us are very patient and kind and forgiving of us. Most of us have very little experience doing masonry work, and yet you were able to take time to teach us. You were very patient when we made mistakes, and uh, more than that, you were fun and wonderful Christian men to work with. So we thank you for your kindness to us, uh, your generosity to us. You cared for us to make sure we were safe. Uh, and we are just so thankful to be a part of the family here at, in Uganda, and especially at Watoto. We especially want to remember as well that there are many wonderful men and women and children and youth back at our church who have made this possible. We are such a small fragment of our congregation, which is a, called a family of Calvary. Uh, nearly 1,100 or 200 people who have collectively over several years saved money, earned money, and shared their gifts of time and talent. And we praise God for them back home, and we hope we'll be able to share this, that this is not our mission. It is a family mission of the family called Calvary, who sends their love from the United States and a place called Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, to a place called Watoto. We are grateful for your children who have touched our lives back in Harrisburg, and that made us want to come here uh, to prayerfully bless other children. I know as we have talked, we are blessed to be with you. The kindness that Melvin has shown, and especially Moses as our team leader here, and every gentleman, we can't say thank you enough. And uh, we praise God for making all, as you have said, all things are wrought by prayer. Without God, the money, the funds, the safety, the journeys, nothing would be possible. Sure. We praise Almighty God and thank you for a wonderful experience here.